Applying textures to walls is fairly straightforward. There's uh, the interface which is very similar to the, the same one that you use when uh, applying textures to roads. You can select the, the side of the wall there and double click to, to change the, the texture. If you wanted to change the top you can go and find a different texture even use some of your road textures on there and apply that. Um, you may want to change some of the advanced settings on there so that it's um, stretched out. Uh, if I grab this and at the moment it's per meter at four uh, per meter at four meters per panel. If you want to stretch that out, um, then away it goes. Um, again, you're in this. Uh, wall shape editor you can press control and create another surface there tell it to set the material as well um, select that same wall piece and then find a, a different material for that and um, it'll just continue on using whatever uh, you've selected for the length of that wall control and click to create another one tell it to set the material hide unused ones is useful once you've got your your good set of materials that you want to use. Um, it limits what's displayed in here to only those textures you are using. So uh, you try and want to, you want to try and limit the amount of different textures you use in your track. So um, again, select the piece you want to manipulate and change it. Again, you may want to change the advanced settings there. You can use the offset. Um, to, well in this case it changed it to start from white to orange to white to orange by putting in 0.5 there. If you did the same on here you're probably not going to get much effect because of the tiling but you'll notice the texture has actually moved up. If we were to use a, a different texture um, let me see maybe some of the ripples that we have Um, there you can see the advanced settings it can be set and you can move this texture up 0 0.5 0 0.5 or change the scaling so that it wraps many times um, so you can get different effects by using the same textures in more creative ways um, to save on using a whole lot of different textures and um, that'll give you different types of feelings to your, your different walls. Um, you can use these buttons to, to rotate. Um, so if we were to come back to, to this here, we could rotate that so that it was striped. And again, you can still move your surfaces back and forth. Makes it all easier, I hope.